Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll be going through how we can fix 0xd000000 d error on Windows Store. So without any further ado, let's get right into it. So the first method is to use Windows app troubleshooting app. So hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in msti settings colon troubleshoot and then hit enter. So once you are inside the troubleshooting app, scroll down to the find and fix other problems tab and then click on Windows Store. Then click on run the troubleshooter. So inside the Windows Store apps troubleshooter, click apply this fix and that would automatically apply the recommended repair strategy. So once the fix is successfully applied, restart your PC and see if the issue still persists or not. Now the solution number two is about installing every pending Windows Store update. So hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in ms settings colon Windows update. So once you are in the Windows update screen, click on check for updates and install the latest updates available. Hopefully they should resolve the issue as well. Now the solution number three is about signing in with Microsoft account. Press Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in ms settings colon email and accounts. So once you are in the email and accounts tab, click on add a Microsoft account and then follow the on-screen steps to enter your account. So once your Microsoft account is connected, instead of using a local account, restart your computer and wait for the next startup sequence to complete. Hopefully this should resolve the issue as well. Now the solution number four is about resetting Windows Store. To reset Windows Store via settings app, hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in ms settings colon apps features. Once you are inside the apps and features screen, scroll down through the list of applications and then locate Microsoft Store. Then navigate to the advanced tab and then click on reset. Now restart your computer and see if the issue still persists or not. You can also reset the Windows Store app via elevated command prompt. Hit Windows key along with R to open up the run dialog and then type in CMD and then click Control Shift Enter simultaneously to open up the elevated command prompt. So once you are inside the command prompt, type in WSRESET.exe and then hit enter. Once the process is complete, restart your computer and see if the issue still persists or not. Hopefully these solutions were helpful for you guys. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We will see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.